individuals involved. Thank you for How tuning in. How a fake Brad Pitt scam resulted in money lost in arrests. Spanish police arrested five people for impersonating Brad Pitt in order to scam women by convincing them that the famed Hollywood actor was in love with them. The two women targeted by the online scammers lost a combined 325,000 euros, 364,000 dollars, Spanish media reported. They were supporting Pitt's first to the person they thought was Pitt, until they re vulnerable, suffering from depression and emotional isolation, which spanned eight provinces, according to a state. Police say that the criminals operated by visiting online platforms for fans of the actor, and built up psychological profiles of the potential victims. They chose the two women, reportedly both aged 60, because they believed they lacked romantic relationships and appeared to be in states of depression. The scammers then sent WhatsApp messages and emails pretending to be Pitt, who does not have any social media presence, and promised future romantic relationships. About celebrity impersonation and online through an online fan site. According to the Guardia Sibyl accused of scamming two women out of 300. My love for you is true. Feeling from my heart and forever. Please forgive me and accept me. It is because I love you and am very much in love with you. One handwritten letter that was found during a search of the criminal's property reads, according to Times of London. After the criminals convinced the victims of Pitt's love, they began suggesting the women invest with him in various projects. Police have since been able to recover approximately $95,000, €85,000 on behalf of the victims. In today's news, a shocking scam has come to light Bain that involves a scammer impersonating none other than stolen funds through their own accounts in exchange for small In a statement to the New York Times, Matthew Hiltzik, a publicist to Pitt, issued a warning about the risks of scams and reminded the public that the actor doesn't have a social media presence. Hiltzik is quoted as telling the publication, it's awful that scammers take advantage of fans' strong connection with celebrities. But this is an important reminder to not respond to unsolicited online outreach, especially from actors who have no social media presence. Damn. The scammers targeted two women, 50,000 euros, 167,000 individuals involved. Thank you for tuning in to talk. Time has reached out to Guardia Civil, the Spanish police agency handling the case for further comment. If you have been scammed, you must act immediately and contact the relevant authorities to alert them of your situation. In the U.S., experts recommend contacting the Federal Trade Commission at the report fraud.ftc.gov. The main cause of action is prevention, but if you do find yourself falling victim to a scam, there are additional steps you can take. That's what we can say, don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe to this news office channel. We thank you all for your support. Wait for other artist news. Stay loyal to this. Thank you. Euros, 167,000. In today's news, a shocking scam has come to light.